I am so happy that you are here today because let me tell you, I have anxiously been waiting to share this Dollar Tree haul with you all and I could not wait any longer. Hey everybody, it's Shelby with a Chick Plus 3. Welcome. I'm so happy that you chose to take some time out of your busy day to keep me company. I really appreciate that. I love jabbing, jarring about the Dollar Tree and I figure, you know what, if you're here at my channel, you probably love the Dollar Tree as much as I do and enjoy seeing Dollar Tree shop with me, Dollar Tree hauls. And so, hey, I am all for sharing anything and everything to do with the Dollar Tree. So what I have for you today is a fabulous brand new Dollar Tree haul filled with the newest items that I found at my Dollar Tree in just the past couple of days. So, without further ado, we're going to jump right into this Dollar Tree haul. What do you say? Let's go! <laughs> All right, decisions, decisions on what to start with, but... I think what I'm going to start with first is this little beauty right here because I want to have some more for breakfast. It is the Toastum, guys. Now, if you are not here, you know how much I love the Dollar Tree Toastums. These beat by a mile for me, the Kellogg's Pop-Tarts. But, 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 do you see that? bonus pack. They are back. So you get four packs of two. So you end up with eight toaster pastries. This is how they come packaged. So they look, you know, just like the Kellogg's ones. Two pastries packed in one packet of foil. But these things are absolutely fabulous. They are a product of the USA. If you eat two pastries, you've consumed 360 calories. For some reason, the Kellogg's Pop-Tarts are 400 calories for two, so these are a little bit less. Now, they do have 410 milligrams of sodium in two. I do limit myself to one Pop-Tart or I'm sorry, toast them, pop up. <laughs> I limit myself to one pastry, which let me tell you is not easy to do. But they had the bonus pack of the strawberry at my Dollar Tree and uh, the uh, brown uh, like sugar ones. But strawberry frosted is my absolute favorite. And uh, strawberry and cherry, my two favorites. So... Of course, I had to grab that. And then this thing, I think, was peeking out, so I'll share this right now. I couldn't believe it, guys, that I found this. Look it. This is heavy duty. This is not some chintzy, cheapy piece of plastic that is going to bust. Look at this thing. It is called a round serving tray by Caterer's Corner. And it is, you know, a Greenbrier product. I'm not sure I've ever seen any label with Caterer's Corner. But, uh, I mean, so they're showing it as a serving tray. But what I'm thinking is this would look gorgeous on uh, my bureau to put like my little nail polishes in or uh, some perfume, just whatever to corral things. If you've got a lot of clutter on top of a surface, um, if you just set it all inside a tray and corral it, then it more visually looks like just like one thing on the surface as opposed to 12 little bottles. So I love using trays because again, it just, it's, I think it's like an optical illusion. It looks like you just have one item on the tabletop and then this can be filled up as opposed to if I just had all the items uh, individually on the tabletop. So 
you know, I'm really thinking I probably should have picked up more than one. If you saw my walkthrough, they did have a big stack of these. And I showed you in the walkthrough where this was found. Never would I have expected to find them where I did. So uh, I was super, super pleased to find that. Oh, and then also I grabbed this because this is another product I really like. It's the Bath and Beauty Micellar uh, Cleansing Water. It cleans and it hydrates. And so I like this because, in all honesty, it's kind of like, to me, the lazy, easy way <laughs> to clean your face. I guess I shouldn't say lazy way, but it's like super convenient. The Dollar Tree sells the packs of cotton rounds, which I love. So you use those um, and some of this, and it just really gets off your uh, makeup. If you wear mascara the way I do, I love mascara. And, you know, especially if you're using those like towelettes, you don't want to be like rubbing and tugging at your eyes, really at any of your skin. That adds to um, like wrinkles, like damage. It honestly does figure, you know, tugging, washing, scrubbing your eyes like that, you know, cup once a day, two times a day, you know, for 50 years. It affects your skin, I think. So to me, this works nice and gentle. And even if I use those towelettes and I clean my face, if I take a cotton round and some of this micellar water and go over my skin, I still find a little bit more uh, grime. So this one that I get at the Dollar Tree is a product of Turkey, okay? And uh, no rinsing in it. There's no alcohol in it, so... To me, that's very important because alcohol definitely dries your skin. Some toners and things that give you that nice, like, fresh feeling, actually, they have, it's put, like, alcohol on your skin. And I personally like to avoid that. So I picked this up at the Dollar Tree. They do put expiration uh, dates on the bottle there. So this one's the end of September 2024. I will use it up uh, long before that. It is eight fluid ounces. So again, made in Turkey. I picked that up. Oh, and then I've never seen this at the Dollar Tree before, the actual Gas X brand. So this is made in Canada. And the active ingredient is the, uh, I say it's simithicone. I'm not sure how you pronounce it, 180 milligrams. But, you know, if you got a problem with gas, this says it relieves it fast. So I thought this would be a good thing to keep in our medicine cabinet. So I grabbed that. Oh, and then Bill was with me and he picked up this Domino, uh, light brown sugar so he got this because he's going to be working on a recipe to share with you all so he grabbed this and the ingredients in this is brown cane sugar so there you go and what is it yes 16 ounces so that is a pound so he picked that up oh and he also picked these up Cracker Jack. I so wish we could find the big bags like the Dollar Tree used to have, but that's all right. Bill grabbed these three boxes, and if you watched our vlog on Saturday, we happened to just be in Walmart. Um, I think we were picking up a dog prescription, and they had these huge cases of Cracker Jill. I got some video of it because I've never seen anything like that. And so it was a lot of fun. Instead of Cracker Jack, it was Cracker Jill um, in honor of uh, Women's Month. It was like one of the women's soccer teams. So I thought that was fun and different. Now, the boxes of Cracker Jack, they do put best use by dates on them, pretty much like any food product, right? So you can find it on the bottom there. This one has, happens to be October 2023. But Bill will eat these up. Now, one box is 120 calories, 70 uh, milligrams of sodium, and it does have 14 grams of sugar. 
also. So just be aware of that because it's only one ounce. And maybe some of you are unfamiliar with Cracker Jack. What it is is caramel coated popcorn and peanuts there. So I find it pretty sticky myself. Uh, they do come with a prize inside, and I know we've had these conversations before. The prizes ain't what they used to be, that's for sure. Now you find your prize, and basically it's a sticker with a code to, you know, go play something online, like an arcade game. So honestly, we don't do anything with the little prize, but... I know I've gone off on discussing prizes and Cracker Jack and cereal before, so I won't waste any more time, but Bill grabbed that, and then our grandson was with us, and he picked this up. Now, if you're familiar with Silly String, this is the Dollar Tree's version, and they call it Goofy String. It is the Spray String, 1.8 ounces. This is a Greenbrier product. It's made in China. The cap tells you what color the string is. And so they have all different colors. He happened to pick out green this time. In fact, back in May in Bill's birthday vlog that is still uh, up on my channel, uh, they had a little silly string showdown. And so that's in that uh Bill's birthday vlog. So they have great fun with this. I do recommend using it outside, but just make sure, please, 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 if you use this outside, that you pick it up so that the birds and the animals don't eat it. And it's very easy, in all honesty, to pick up because it's just like this, like foam stuff. So, but that's what we got. And yeah, is in any of this like type of toy stuff, just be aware it could stain things. So that's why we like to use it outside. But again, if you do, just please clean it up. Mother Nature will thank you. Oh, and then Bill picked this up. And so I'm sure this is for his recipe also. It's a product of Thailand and it is the coconut. Um, it's distributed by MW Polar Foods in California. So the ingredients in this are coconut, water, and then it has a stabilizer called guar gum in it. Um, so, and then an emulsifier. But 60 calories, uh, and there's five servings in this container. But Bill uses this usually in things like cakes or pudding. So I don't know what recipe he's cooking up to use the coconut milk this time. But he grabbed himself that, 13.5 ounces of coconut milk. And then, oh... I found the replacement heads for my battery-operated toothbrush. Thank you. You know who you are that told me these were available. So I was super excited. These are the Luminant Soft Replacement Toothbrush uh, Heads. It says they work with the battery-powered toothbrush. I got to tell you guys, I've been loving my battery-powered toothbrush. So the replacement head is there when yours wears out or you just want to replace it. You know, dentists, I think, say, what, every six months replace our toothbrushes. Or the other thing, if you really wanted to just own one base, uh, I guess you could use two, you know, like multiple users and just replace the heads. I don't know. You could do that, right? That's what you do with water picks. It comes with multiple picks and different family members can use a different one. But in all honesty, at $1.25 for the battery operated toothbrush and it comes with the battery and one head already on it and different colors. I think it's fun for everybody to be able to just have their own. All right, and I'm finding all kinds of stuff in this bag that I didn't even know was there. But these I do know because I picked these up. Look at that by Scoonchie. In the walkthrough, I showed 
all kinds of scoochy products and aren't these little butterfly clips gorgeous so they're the little you know claw clips there you get four of them these beautiful colors and so i um got these for a gift i think they're adorable and then to go with them look at this again by scoochy and this guys is so soft so it's the hair band but then it has this little built-in uh tie on it so how pretty and i wish you could feel this it feels so nice um i just really love it and it seems like this time of year especially when it's like the dollar trees back to school time they put out a lot of i feel like extra hair accessory type of things so i mean you know you could put this in a ponytail and have it there have it in the back um so really pretty and they had all different ones all right the next thing i grabbed is just a big refill of this spa soap this is the aloe cream soap 32 fluid ounces and uh this is made in canada i don't know if you can see that but the aloe and chamomile refill soap i think that's a good deal for a dollar 25. Bill picked this up, I I don't know, a dollar twenty-five for just the VO5 shampoo. I don't know how awesome of a deal that is, but you know, it's kind of sometimes when you need something, you need it, and so it can be more cost effective than driving all over. And he did good because he grabbed the one that was the bonus one there on the shelf. So you got uh one point eight fluid ounces. Uh I'm sorry, 18 fluid ounces. 1.8 wouldn't have been much. So he got 18 ounces instead of 15. So he did a good job by picking up the uh, bonus pack. And this also, VO5, guys, is a product of Canada, made in Canada. So I don't know if you knew that. And he got the volumizing one. They had all different... Uh, shampoos there and then he also he and the grand picked this up this time they went for a matchbox the dollar tree does have a huge selection of matchbox cars and hot wheels they are a dollar 25 though and so um i gotta tell you i think at target we saw hot wheels for dollar 19 i believe but they had a very limited selection i don't know you know the dollar tree why they have such a huge variety or if it's just the dollar trees here in our area but huge variety of matchbox and hot wheel cars so this one is a 2021 ford mustang so they grabbed that one and then, oh, this is in my top 10 favorite Dollar Tree products. And I was actually thinking the other day that I should do a top 10 uh, video for you guys. I don't know. I think maybe I did once before, but it's really hard for me to narrow down. But there are products that, you know, I just on a weekly basis buy at the Dollar Tree are the second I run out, I grab one or I always have one in reserve. And this is one of those products. I probably have showed you guys this a hundred times, no joke, but it is the Ultra Shine Dish Detergent Packs. You get 10 in this package, okay? Um, this is made in the USA, so that is a great thing. And 10 dish detergent packs. I think that's an awesome deal. We love these. They work. So this definitely is one of my uh, top 10 Dollar Tree products. All right, I guess I'm going to wrap it up there because um, I am just sitting outdoors enjoying the forest, but there's starting to be a lot of people walking around and um, which they don't bother me, but I'm 
afraid. I don't want to make anybody uncomfortable or wary about, you know, who's that chick hanging out in the car. You know, I'm just here trying to enjoy the uh, nature, you know, or walk my dog or something. So <laughs> I'm going to wrap this up here. But I truly appreciate each and every one of you choosing to take time out of your day and hang out with me, hang out with Bill and I, the grands, you know, everything that we have going on here. Um, we so enjoy having you along for the ride with us. So we will be back again very shortly. And remember, our friends, until then, please be well.